Ryan Tunnicliffe, welcome to Luton Town. How does it feel to be here? Uh, really excited. Uh, can't wait to get going now. Uh, been a long bit of a drawn out process doing the contracts, but uh, can't wait to get going. When did you first find out that it was a possibility then? Uh, probably about six weeks ago or something like that. I think I, I met the gaffer uh, probably about four or five weeks ago. Uh, well, after the season finished, uh, he wanted to, to get to know me face to face and, and see my personality and, and that's when I knew that uh, something could happen here. Obviously what you said to him must have impressed him, <laughs> but what did he say to you that impressed you and, and persuaded you to join Luton Town? Uh, obviously just, just knowing his resume to start with, where he's worked and, and the people he's worked with was is impressive off the bat, but uh, you know, just sitting and talking to him, listening to how he likes to play the game, how this year he's, he's planning on playing, uh, just just really excited me and, and I can't wait to get stuck into it. So you've got vast amounts of experience in the, the top flight and the, the championship and you'd have come up against Graham before, I presume, at uh, your previous clubs? Uh, yeah, probably, yeah. Uh, like I said, I've, I've, I've been around this, this level for, even though I'm only 26, seems like a long time now. Uh, played quite a few games from my age, so uh, yeah, I've just obviously I'm sort of not really in my prime yet and I'm, I'm quite experienced so uh, hopefully I can I can bring that to the squad. What can the supporters expect then going into this division because it's all new for, for Luton Town fans um, from where we've been in recent seasons, mm -hmm. successive promotions now into the Championship? Uh, well I think everyone first and foremost knows what a competitive league it is but uh, on the same on the same hand anyone can beat anyone as we've seen over the years so uh, I think they can expect Obviously, it was to, to give it a right goal, play some good football and, and, and try our best to win every game that we're playing. And what can the fans expect from you as a player? You know, you perhaps haven't come up against Luton no. before, so <coughs> they may not have seen you in the flesh. Uh, what they can expect, uh, just just first and foremost, give 110% every time I put, put the shirt on. Uh, but, but other than that, someone who likes to get on the ball, been brought up, obviously where I've been brought up and, and playing football. So. Uh, Get on the ball, make things happen, work, energy, box to box, tackle, uh, everything that, that you would expect from a centre midfielder really. As you say where you've been brought up, it's Manchester United and, yeah. and, and then Fulham, obviously loan spells at uh, Peterborough and elsewhere. Mm -hmm. um, the philosophy is one that at those clubs is one that will tie in with what Graham Jones wants to play. Yeah, that, that's, why I'm, that's why I'm really excited because uh, like you said, growing up with, with obviously the philosophies of the ball at my feet, passes, little angles, attacking, front foot football uh, is, is something that, that I'm really looking forward to, to getting back to. Um, yeah, I can't wait, I really can't wait. And last season, obviously you've come from Millwall, mm -hmm. um, who you left at the end of the season, made over 30 appearances at FA Cup quarterfinals <laughs> as well. A bit of a scrap at the bottom, but uh, you know, a, a all round beneficial season for you? Uh, yeah, I think, I think probably the most beneficial in my career because like I said previously I've been brought up predominantly just playing football angles attacking stuff and uh, and being there for the past two seasons has really brought something to my game that, that I, I, I thought I had but I didn't have uh, in it which is obviously heads, tackles, second balls, anticipating knockdowns and stuff like that which is obviously the way Millwall play. Uh, it's, it's really uh, made me a, a, lot, a lot better player than, than I was when I first stepped in that building. And do you know any of the boys already here? Uh, yeah, I know a few of them. I know uh, I've played with, with Callum McManaman at Wigan. One of my loan spells, uh, Martin Craney as well. I was with him at, at Barnsley when I was younger, so uh, some familiar faces and hopefully they uh, welcome me with open arms. I'd say nice that the three new boys coming <laughs> together all, all know each other. It helps you, doesn't it, settle in at a club? Yeah, obviously uh, the first day I, I walk through and see the lads to see a familiar face will we'll obviously ease my nerves, but. Uh, I'm a big boy, so I'm, I'm not too worried about meeting the new lads. I've, I've heard they're a great set, so I uh, can't wait to, to get on the training pitch with them and, and, and really uh, get stuck into the season. Welcome to Newton Town, Ryan. Thank you, sir.